Okay, everyone. I'm going to show you how Prime can become your best friend if you have a nitrite spike. Maybe your tank crashed, you know. Maybe something went wrong, you cleaned too much. Then you got a nitrite spike and now your cycle is all messed up, your tank is all messed up, and you need to get your parameters back down. Now I'm going to show you how this works. You see how this is purple right here? That's a high nitrite spike right there. Purple, 5.0 on the nitrite, okay? Now I'm going to show you how this prime right here will take those nitrites down just to give you some time so that way everything doesn't go into disaster mode and you start losing everything just while you're trying to build your tank back up. Get your beneficial bacteria back up there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the cap off of this. Okay. And I'm going to take this prime, and I'm going to add some of this into this test tube. So that way you can see what this prime does when you have a nitrite spike, okay? So. Put a little in there. Shake it up a little bit. It's going to turn that blue color. See it? It's not purple anymore. And that went down significantly. Took it right down. So let it sit there for a minute. You'll see, you can see the blue on the white down here. See that blue color coming in? And you keep putting that prime in there. You know, 25% water change, add a little prime. Don't do too much more than 25% if you crash your cycle or whatever. Just a 25% water change and a little bit of that prime. You can do up to five times the amount with the prime. So just until you get your beneficial bacteria kicking back in and your tank be all cycled and everything. But look at that. See that? A little prime is everything. It works. Just to keep everything down so that way you don't lose no fish or anything. That's the way to go. Don't let nobody tell you anything different. And use a little bit of stability to try to build up your beneficial bacteria along with it. You're good to go. Peace.